Good morning, my students. Today, inshallah, we are going to have our third unit, unit number one, and the title is uh, Learning Styles. Look here, we are talking about learning styles. What does it mean, learning styles? Learning means that we have different styles when we study. We have different styles when we study. What we mean by styles, styles mean methods, way in studying. Look here to the arrows. We have visual, oral, and physical. Visual, oral, and physical. قبل هيك أنا بعدت لكم صفحة على الكلاس موجود فيها all the description about visual, oral, physical styles. Now look to the pictures. We have here some students. Number one, she is oral. She is hearing. The second is reading, visual. And this person is working, so he is physical. Now let us revise together what does it mean these styles so we are talking about the learning styles and we said we have visual oral and physical three learning styles let us start with visual look here visual is learning by reading textbook then ana talama ana visual learner ana mutaallam visual ish mali ana learning by reading Reading what? Textbook. زي ما احنا في المدرسة بنتعلم بواسطة الكتاب. Or watching cards. زي ما الانت بتجيب لك cards وبتورجيك اياهم. Or watching videos. So you are a visual learner. So this is the first one. Visual learner. The second is. Before starting with the second. This is here. We have a girl. And she is reading. So she is. Visual, visual. I mean reading or watching, so what cards, so what videos. So she is visual. Now here somebody is hearing, maybe hearing music, maybe hearing sound words. So this student is oral, oral. What does it mean oral? Oral means learning by. Hearing, we are learning learning by hearing, hearing words, hearing sounds. So we are oral learners. The third one, the third one is physical. Look here to the girls; they are playing, and this boy he is making an experiment. عمل بعمل تجربة. So, so physical means using your body, practicing, using hands. So when I am a physical learner, I use my body, I use my hands, I practice. Practice يعني يمارس. يعني يستخدم جسمه يستخدم إيدي في عمل تجارب في اللعب like the girls. Here, the girls are. Playing, they are playing, and the boy here he is making an experiment. So all of them are physical learners. So how many do we have? We have visual, oral, and physical. Now let's move to the second point. Here we said we have three styles. Aura, visual, aura, and physical, and we understand now what does it mean: visual, reading, watching, oral, hearing, sounds, words, physical, using your body. Look to the girl; she is oral; she is hearing. Look to the boy; he is visual; he is reading, and this boy; he is. Physical. He is playing, working. Now,
we have some a new vocab we have some new vocabulary here in our lesson look at them style what does it mean style style means way or method and this is a noun style style the second one social social and it's an adjective when you are good at dealing with people so you are social noun minha society now we have the word solitary solitary means alone and it is an adjective alone means wahid يعني لحاله so some people are social بيحبوا يكونوا في مجموعة بيحبوا يشتغلوا مع الجماعة solitary بيحبوا يكونوا لحالهم ما بيحبوا معاهم مجموعة another word obviously obviously means clearly and this is an adverb هي حال clearly معناها بوضوح another one according to means relating to According دائما بيجي معها preposition to means relating to ومعناها على حسب so another time style social solitary obviously according to okay these are the main vocab now let's move to the main points in our lesson here we said that we have three styles look at them we have visual oral physical Students can learn using a mixture of the three styles. What do we mean by mixture? Mixture means the word mixture means to mix. في المطبخ في عنا mixture mixer هو الخلاط. So the verb mix mix بمعنى يخلط. إذا as a learner كأنتي كمتعلم تقدر تستخدمي all the styles and you can mix تقدر تستخدميهم كلهم وتعملي mixing between them according to what على حسب شو انت بتستخدمي styles تبعونك اللي هم visual, oral, physical according to the subject يعني لو كان درسنا science علوم حتستخدمي for example uh, hearing your uh, uh, teacher حتسمعي مدرستك وشرحها then you are using your hands to make an experiment to make something to work with your colleagues تشتغلي مع صحباتك فهذا physical and when you are studying English لما انت تدرسي في اللغة الإنجليزية مع مدرستك maybe you are hearing her ممكن تسمعيها ممكن تنفذي وتطبقي وتستخدمي الفيزيكال واي وممكن كمان you are watching you are reading textbooks so you are visual so student can mix احنا بنقدر نعمل خليط ما بين all the styles يعني ما بن ما بنقسمهم ما بنفرقهم ممكن نعمل mix between them you choose the style according to your subject and you can improve it وبتقدر انت تطوري حسب الشو اللي بناسبك انت but we said some people are social and others are solitary شو يعني social قلنا social means social means اجتماعي solitary بحب يكون لحاله so as a learner كطالب انت you can't be both social and solitary ما بتقدر تكون التنين you should choose one of them يعني انت ما بتقدر تكوني من المحبين لانك تكوني مع الجماعة وانك تكوني من الناس اللي بتحب العزلة لحالة ما بنفع التنين so you should choose between one of them so our lesson for today is about what about the learning styles visual oral physical and we said that also we have two kinds of learners we have social I mean visual oral and social yes we can mix نقدر نخلط ما بين الستايلز اللي احنا تعلمناهم but can you mix between or to be a social and solitary at the same time no you should choose social or solitary now here we have an exercise
I wanted from you to read and then complete Camellia and send it to me and to our class. نقرأ مع بعض complete number one oral learners learn better by بتعلموا كيف بكونوا أشطر كيف في الأورال visual learners learn by والفيجوال شو عايزين physical students use their الفيزيكال شو بيستخدموا number four students can learn using a of learning styles You can go to the textbook. تقدر تروح على الكتاب على الصفحة اللي إحنا شفناها. And you can complete. Learners cannot be both. Learners cannot be both. ما بيقدر يكونوا حاجتين. شو هم الحاجتين اللي حكينا عنهم? Student choose their styles according to على حسب شو بيستخدموا الستايل تبعهم. So I want it from you. I want it from all of you to send me the answers. In our class room, okay. Goodbye for today, inshallah. And tomorrow I will send you the rest of the exercises. Goodbye.